President Zelensky is warning that this war has reached a new stage of terror. <laughs> we are actually just 50 miles from the border with Ukraine, and they are manning this air defense system 24-7 to be ready for anything. Some of the most innocent victims trapped in the crosshairs of the war are those whose lives are just beginning. Meanwhile, the humanitarian crisis is growing by the hour as millions flee their homes in hopes of escaping the violence. Most people just all they have is a small suitcase, like a carry-on bag almost, and that's it's their entire belongings that they're bringing with them. Like an orange? You do? Do you want me to get you one? Why do you do this? Um, Recognize the human race as one. We the human race is one. Oh my gosh, where did you come from? Katya. Katya. Nice to meet you. You okay? I think about in the face of such evil that you found such kindness. As war inches closer here to Poland, many of the people we saw, they're tired, they're scared. Many of them, they just want to go back home. A bus just arrived just a couple of minutes ago before we came up here. How long have you been traveling? Before 11 days, I, I live in a bar near Kiev. People have been traveling for days from Kharkiv, a mother carrying her baby. Oh my goodness, are you okay? These people are so tired, and all they have with them are like two small roller bags and some backpacks. You must be exhausted. Are you so tired? No. So tired. Well, I'm sorry. Come inside. There's rest inside. They come to a place like here, a reception area. It's dark now because they're sleeping for many people.